That line formed early this morning in Fayetteville, Arkansas. Hoping to watch their Arkansas Razorbacks, the number 18 team in the country. Can they upset number six, Kentucky? That's our matchup. Two minutes in, Arkansas still looking for their first point. Williams will get it for him. Jalen Williams. Think about it and try it from the Help same him. spot. This one rims out and Williams will clear it. He's doing the Razorbacks a favor if he stays out there yep. all the time. He'll be drawing fouls. No take. Doubled inside and still scores. Second leading score in the SEC, J.D. Note. Just under 19 a game for J.D. overall. And even better than that in the SEC action. Here's Brooks had it blocked. And Williams will get it ahead to Note. Note deep. Got it! Oh. Woo. Early timeout by John Calipari. Inside for the slam. Great pass by Jason with a couple of early turnovers. He's a tremendous player, but it's not easy going into this atmosphere. Note another one to Wade. Kick out. This guy is going to shoot the three. No take. Way outside. That was from Little Rock. What a shot. It's a four point shot. Game. He gets about wow. six offensive rebounds a game, including that last one, and that's why he's shooting 60%. Get the rebound, put it right back up there. An amazing player. JD Note is out of hot tear. He's got 10 early. Tremendous play. Scores once again 23% of their points when he's on the floor. Keepway rolled one in and one. Opening, didn't take it. Washington will feed it inside. Shibway, extra pass, and it's a beauty. Oh. Lightning quick. Transfer from Miami. Baseline jumper. Not an easy shot. A game earlier this year, which is unheard of, and he's had several games of 20 or more, and he's up to that kind of start today. And a three-pointer goes for Brooks. They we're down 13 after that 15-0 run, so... This is a lot better spot for Mint, or uh, not Mint, Note off the window. Again. Here's the matchup, two of the better guards in the conference. Xavier Wheeler, J.D. Note, battle goes all the way to the floor. The kick out to Williams, Amude on the extra pass for three. And Arkansas going to push it. Note in some traffic and still on the dribble. Still got the shot away and got it. Wow, so that was not a timeout, a turnover. It took too much time on the baseline. Oh, Are you kidding me? Don't be so mean. Don't wow. be so rough. That's not fair, bro. That is something. We haven't seen a shooting display like this from a guard, at least I haven't this year. Not me either. Match their biggest lead now, up 13. Tata Washington misses on the outside. Nice follow and a flush by Brooks. Kamani Johnson, as you said. Approaching the four-minute mark. Arkansas, double-digit lead. Nice speed inside and the finish by Adis. Chibway from the outside. Knew that wasn't going in again. Tried to get his own rebound and couldn't. Williams did. He's taken four outside, made one, 25%, but... Maybe he maybe shouldn't have hit that first one. <laughs> that's, that's what happens. <laughs> this guy's hit it from everywhere. Now, when a guy's going First crazy like the this... Right? on their home floor with a 15-1 and one this year. Note lost the handle. Kentucky looking to run. Xavier Wheeler out in front. Got it. His window. first point. Nice break. Kentucky played a poor half. Arkansas played a beautiful half. And it's 34 to 28 at the end of the first half. Over 12 a game. Ty Ty Washington, normally about 13 a game, too. Here's Sabir Wheeler off the window. I don't think he called that, but he'll take it. Brad, it's 2-22 in Fayetteville, Arkansas, okay? Make a deposit, get some interest, don't let up. Get some money. The lead down to three after that three by Wheeler, but immediately... Back comes <laughs> J.D. No. I'm not going to the transfer court, but, but the thing is now, you mentioned before, Kentucky used to have the one and done, the young guys, now they get yep, old guys. They, they get do. a million guys in the transfer court. That one of the oldest teams oh, they've ever had, except the opening basket of the ball game, and now 
their lead's in danger because Kentucky's putting a move on and they cut it to one with Keon Brooks. Wildcats are playing well, they're running, now they're running. And they're guarding Note a little bit closer as well. That time left Tony open though. Five minutes Body. into the game, the important five minutes to start the half as Pete said, and with that, Kentucky's made the push to only down one. They might be in the front after that shot, and they are. Nice Euro step, heck of a move. Wheeler's out of the game now. We'll see how Kentucky adjusts for a few minutes without their little point. Whoa! Whoa! He's done it every way possible, including a one-handed slam. Sheboy got his own miss. Might have to go back up with it again. Does and got it. A strong double-double for a guy that might be the national player of the year. Who knows? No take. <laughs> now, this is something to watch, really. Back and forth we go now with 12 and a half to go. And J.D. Note and Oscar Sheboy are putting on a show for us here in the SEC on CBS today. Lob to the big fella, scored again. Been here at about 9 o'clock last night after the gymnastics meet, shooting, and then we talked about his shooting before the game as Jalen Williams knocks one down from mid-range. Sheboy, Williams on his shoulder, outside the wheeler. Brooks back to Sheboy underneath. Get the ball to Williams, let him touch it. And Washington, nice defense, good hands ahead to Keon Brooks with the lay-in. Brooks has been big in the second half. Eight points in the half, and this is the biggest Kentucky lead of the game. Credit to defense by Kentucky. We talked about Razorbacks did an outstanding job in the first half. Right now, all right, I think Kentucky's doing a great job defensively. Williams runs into Sheboy, gets it back outside. J.D. Note, mid-range, long-range, inside. He hasn't missed a lot. It's easy money for him. Great. Easy money. Coach, take me out. <laughs> Are you bleak? I don't know, but it's hard to <laughs> It's definitely injured. No take. Way up off the window. Yes. Tie game. Wheeler changes that. Two little guards taking over the game. Who's going to blink first? Note. Trying to get a shot up there. Tony tried to keep it alive, and now they do keep it alive. And a three goes for Abude. Razorbacks regain the lead. A great game with two great teams. They're going to make deep runs in the NCAA tournament. Abude gets double teamed. On the inbounds pass. Gets it back in the corner, and he'll take it from there. Got it! Wow. Two. Note draws a double team, and that leaves wide open Kamani Johnson. Two. Johnson was the two. And it's Kentucky down by four. Wheeler will try three. Got it! This one's clean. Wheeler trying to penetrate, lays it up, and it rolls around and in. Was looked like somebody touched it above the rim. Yep. That was close. It could have been an offensive goaltender. I couldn't tell. It was blocked down a little bit. <laughs> Even again at 63. They're tied at two, tied at 41, tied at 61, and now even at 63 with four and a half to go. And one for Jalen Williams. That's what he can do. He's too Washington, tough shot, baseline, got it. The crowd kind of taking a pause here, knowing it's going to be a fantastic finish. Jalen Williams from the elbow. Sheway can't guard him. He's too quick. Stay way off him. He can make that shot. Not a great three-point shooter or outside shooter, but he's solid. That pause that the crowd took is over. Giant possession for the Wildcats. Got to get a good shot. Washington trying to get around Tony. Finally did. Way up off the window. Sheboy tips it in. Left two, two and a half to play. 
Wheeler working against Note. Now long three and it goes for Grady. Hadn't scored all day. High post screen for Note. Screen trying to get to the rim. JD drops it off to Williams with a hook shot. I run out again. Two of your best players with the ball. No take off the high ball screen. It was difficult to see if any official could actually see it, so they they did the right thing and took a quick look at the monitor and came up with the right answer. Well, the fans didn't think it was the right answer, but they got their wish anyway because Kentucky just turned around and turned it right back over. He's played a brilliant game again today here. And he's dead tired. He's got it. And Danielle Musselman cheering on her husband's team. Hey, as they a score three point us. He has one field goal in this half. Keon Brooks will take the three. Sheboy trying to keep it alive. He and Williams battle. Arkansas gets the ball. And a foul now on Grady against Devontae Davis. And the crowd is going wild at Bud Walton. Eight or nine seconds. I, I fouled early as a head coach. I did it 20 times, and we won every time we did it. All right, now, you're up four. Don't foul now. You're up four. Wheeler brings it down. Ten to go. Washington had it knocked out of bounds by Note. That's put the two possession game. Going to drive to the basket. Get fouled. Three pointer. Knocked out of bounds. No, not out of bounds. And now it's a run out. This one's over. Or are they going to call a foul in the backcourt? We're going to find out here in a second when Doug Shaw says it's Arkansas ball. And we'll get you that game in just a minute. Kentucky is walking off the courts with 4.4 seconds to go and heading to the locker room. And there's just five guys in blue jerseys left. So they've conceded, I guess, at this point as Washington takes a shot off the window and it goes and it will count and it's a two-point win for Arkansas they beat then number one Auburn they've now beaten number six Kentucky and they have won 13 of their last 14 what a game and what a finish